What's up, guys? How's it going, everybody? Oh, I'm so excited. He's really excited. So, uh, <sighs> out of nowhere, like I feel like we're always saying with these reactions now. Uh, is there a website that's just like schedules every trailer? Is it literally just like whenever a right. studio feels like it? I just woke up this morning and bam, the uh, trailer number one for Send Lion King. cute little face. Uh, even though this is like at least our <coughs> second. What? Our second trailer or is it? Our third look somewhere around there. Third We've look. Had, like two teasers. No, this, this is this trailer. So this mm -hmm. is probably kind of like our story trailer is what right. I'm getting at. Um, <sighs> Dude, I'm so ready. I got my fucking... Panther shirt, closest thing I got to a cat. You don't have like a little, a little... kitty cat. Not yet. Shut up. Okay. I'll get there. Okay. I don't buy clothes. Well, I just have what I had since like high school. Since this is like your favorite Disney movie, maybe you should get a shirt themed around it. I'm gonna get like five. I'm already fair. wear one for every day of the week leading up to it. Exactly. Um, my only thing is I I, I just need to see Pumbo. Yeah, we're, we're not seeing much in this little preview. Yeah. So let's stop spoiling it. You know what? Let's just let's just jump here we it. go. Ooh, Life's look at their little bounciness. <laughs> Is it my little friend? Oh. Well, some are born to feast. Is it Scar talking? Others yeah. spend their lives in Scar. The oh, he looks scary. They all look scary. Begging for scraps. Oh. I mean, they just look like hyenas, but he looks terrifying. Yeah. Everything you see exists together in a delicate balance. Woo. Oh, he's. I just thought he's not blue, but. <laughs> While others search for what they can take, a true king searches for what he can give. Oh, the pie for first. Oh, the music. Oh. Hans Zimmer knows what he's doing. And never return. Never return. Oh, there he is. There he is. Look at the <laughs> man. Look at the Oh, his little tail. <laughs> oh, we're getting all the scenes. Seriously, they're showing. It's not a bad thing. They're just yeah, showing every little like, clip for everything. Say it with your chest. Oh. I'm so ready. No. He just. He's so happy. He looks like a like a little Ellie. He looks like a little Ellie. He does look like a little Ellie. Even though they're probably the same size. Um, well, that was the trailer. Wow. Um, Initial thoughts? Did you hate it? I think you hated it. That was the best thing ever. It's complete garbage? No. Uh, Endgame? This. If I had to choose one, which one do I only see? I don't know. You really would... I don't want to make the choice. You would really pick The Lion King over... No, I didn't say anything. I was just putting them next to each other. Endgame, hands down, because at least we have... The original classic to fall back on. We got comic book, which is good. Yeah, probably in game. Um, That's the logistics of it. But here's like, so <sighs> obviously you're really excited for it. I'm looking forward to it, but after seeing this trailer, my only gripe it's what I've had with the last the teaser trailer is I don't think it's as colorful because it's going for like a realistic route. I know that it's just that like I can see that the classic one. Uh, is just so beautiful with the vibrant colors that they pick and like the now I just thought of it uh, I just want to be king song mm -hmm. where like all the flamingos and the rhinos and everything they're all just dancing and the flowers and it's so pretty like how is that song gonna work in there's, this movie there's no way that uh I just thought about this that um with the jungle book John Favreau same guy yep he only did a few of the songs. If he does the same thing here, I might be a little peeved. I want to hear, like, eight of the songs. Well, that's what, like, is this going to be a musical, like, mm -hmm. a musical in the sense of, like, Beauty and the Beast, where, like, they would sing songs, but there was dialogue? Right. Or is it going to be Lion, or is it going to be Jungle Book, where they just pick, like, two songs? Like, what if they just, I mean, obviously, 
we just heard them start singing Akuna Matata, but what mm-hmm. if that's it? Like in the Jungle Book, like, you know, Baloo just starts singing the song, uh, The Bare Necessities, right. kind of just out of nowhere, just like, okay, this is mm-hmm. this doesn't really work. But then in this, what if they just start singing Akuna Matata and like that's the only song? Right. And maybe can we feel that, that's probably the only thing I fear about this movie. Because like everything else, I'm on board with. Scar looks amazing, and like you said, the color's gone, but he's got like a distinct look, and it's yeah. the realism. Because he's supposed to have like greenish he's, eyes or yellow eyes. I think they're green. Yeah, they're they're green. They're, and then he's a much darker tone. Yeah, like, I, I mean, I'm gonna I'm gonna miss mane. that red and black for mm-hmm. sure. I'm gonna miss that a little bit. Well, um, like, Lions don't look like that, so that makes sense. But he's, it makes he's sense. Skinny. He is skinny. He's got the little the little chip on his ear. Gone from his ear. He looks a lot rougher. Oh yeah, he he's been through some shit. Um, I, I'm hearing a little. Uh, I'm getting a Thanos vibe from Scar. I mean Disney. Run from it. They know how to market their trailers, I guess. Um, Pumba. I mean, he looks what he's supposed to look like, but it looks terrifying. At least to the me. The contrast between Timon and Pumba. Like Timon got cuter. Pumba got uglier, uh, scarier. <laughs> like yeah, Timon looks freaking adorable. Like I just kind of want to like. Pum Pumba's hairy. Just hold him. He's hairy. He is. He's hairy. got that warthog hair. It's, it's Seth Rogen. Is that an insult? The Seth Rogen. <laughs> nope, nope. <laughs> <laughs> there, I can't. That, that was that was <laughs> second attempt was better. Um, Such Zazu. A laugh. I guess. I guess they're. I assume when they first made him, they just kind of made up a bird. Mm-hmm. And so I mean, he did have a little bit of white at least. So it is, he's he's white now with a little bit of blue. It's definitely the beak is what's yeah. messing oh, up yeah. with me because I kind of had like that part in the center. I think they took a real bird and just put Toucan Sam's beak. On <laughs> right. him. Pretty much, they wanted to make a little more cartoony. Or you know, we're not zoologists, so we could be dead wrong. And maybe the one from the mo- the animated movie was a real bird, and they're like, let's do this bird instead. Dude, I'm kind of scared now because, so this morning. I like wake up and I look at my phone and like I just see the trailer and so I just kick down Caleb's door, shine my phone in his face and he's like, let's go. <laughs> and then for like an hour, <laughs> Caleb is just jamming out to Lion King music and so now this is kind of... It's kind of scary, the thought of not hearing that's what I'm like, iconic songs. Because <clears throat> uh, Can You Feel the Love Tonight, it's them singing it, right? Or is it just some voice? It's all of them. Uh, Timon and Pumbaa. Nala, yeah, okay, and so they all are singing it. Okay. Simba. Oh, that voice crack. Embarrassing. <laughs> um, Thunder crack. Uh, yeah, I, it kinda, it, I'm kind of worried about that now. Like, I need to know, because like in Aladdin, you definitely see Aladdin and Jasmine ba-da, seeing ba-da, like a whole ba-da. new world. And maybe, so, like, maybe Disney learned their lesson. With the Jungle like, Book? Like they're feeling like they got to put the songs in. Well, that's why, like, I'm hoping that mm-hmm. the next trailer, because there definitely will be a second trailer, we see Simba maybe singing I Just Can't Wait to Be King, and then I'm like, okay, the songs are in there. Or we hear Can You Feel the Love Tonight, or we hear a little bit more of uh, Akuna Matata, who knows? Because, right. I mean, the circle of life, that's just kind of like a song. Like, nobody's really singing it, so... I mean, they, they do sing at the, the second half of it. Oh, they do? Mm-hmm. I don't remember that. Yeah. Like they they do the the hymns and whatnot, and then it goes into uh, well, duh, because they they lead up to the circle of life. Ba-na-na. But like the animals sing that. Oh no, the animals don't sing. I'm just no, saying, that's but... what I was. No, no, okay. that's what like I'm saying. The circle of life song is just like people singing it. It's mm-hmm. not the it's not the character singing it. So that song is definitely gonna be. Maybe in. they'll put a little impromptu and make some of the animals in the crowd sing it. It's all John Oliver and Zazu singing it. <laughs> now I'm just kind of worried about the music. But... Of all things, for that to be the only thing to worry about, I'm okay with it. I don't know. It's kind of a big thing. Oh, Can neat. you go into the movie knowing that what if they don't sing any of the songs besides like Akira Matata? Wouldn't that be depressing? Yeah, I'm just not going to think about it. <laughs> I'm okay with that. Well, guys, on that note... It's going to be in Dolby. Ooh. You're going to feel the stampede. You're going to feel like you're Mufasa. And never return. I'm definitely playing Kingdom Hearts 2 before we watch this movie. Now, do we watch the two movies before watching this? There's actually three. Oh, like the the like one and a half one? Yeah. yeah. 
Um, and then do we watch? I mean, the, I have. Do we I, watch I have the, the first movie one. or the yeah the Timon movie after that too? Do we just watch every? Do we watch the TV? There show? were so many spinoffs. There was like two TV shows. Oh, the TV show's still going, isn't it? And the newer one is at least. Yeah, and Disney XD. Oh my gosh. Anyway, they were gonna wrap it here, guys. So good. It's been a good one. This has been Caleb. Andrew. Peace. Bye.